With now two promising vaccines nearing final stages, here's the question. Will Americans feel comfortable taking them in just a matter of months? News Nation anchor Nicole Burley set out today to find out. Nicole. Well, Rob, I kind of have the answer for you. With no specific plan on how a vaccine would be distributed once it's available, there's still a lot of uncertainty when it comes to how we will move forward. So I went out and spoke with people in downtown Chicago asking if they plan to get the vaccine if and when it's on the market. Even in the middle of a pandemic, downtown Chicago is still bustling with people. Of course, what's different in 2020 is that most of these people are wearing masks. COVID-19 has affected all of us, and an effective COVID-19 vaccine could impact us even more. But will people get it? When it's available, will you get the vaccine? Yes, I will. I'll be one of the first ones probably to get the vaccine. I think we all need to get the vaccine to be able to get rid of this and really be safe to open it back up. We get vaccines for everything nowadays, so I think one more added to our list is only just saving us from everything. But not everyone sees it that way. They point to safety concerns, especially around how quickly it's being developed and tested. That's a tricky question. <laughs> Well, I guess it just depends on the results that come out. Personally, I don't know. I really wouldn't trust it because there's so many theories about the whole COVID thing. So it's really something to think about before actually getting the vaccine. No, I would not. Why not? I don't. One, I don't feel it's been tested as long. Um, I've had COVID. I'm not afraid of it. I don't feel it's something we need to run and hide from. So, no, I don't trust it. I honestly do not trust the makers of the vaccine. I. I have very strong opinions on this COVID, no, so <laughs> I do. I'm a nurse and, um, you know, vaccination is the, the way that we'll actually protect the public. I'll certainly get, in a, uh, get a vaccine once it's available and I know what the profile of the risk is, because at the moment they're saying it's successful, but you don't know what the risk level is. I'm not prepared to take something I don't know anything about. It's as simple as that. But for some people, it's as simple as wanting to get back to some type of normalcy. Once it's available, will you get the vaccine? Yes, I will. And you didn't find out any hesitation? No, no hesitation at all. Okay. Like, it's worse than wearing this every day. I don't think anything will be more terrible wearing this, trying to breathe. It's just better than not doing anything at all. It's better than keeping things still and nothing is happening. So let's give it a try. The majority of people I spoke with say they either don't want the vaccine or at the very least, they don't want to be part of the first group receiving it. Now, one interesting pattern I noticed, people have already made up their minds, whether it's yes or no to the vaccine, not one single person had to stop and think. They answered immediately.